School districts throughout our area have extended teacher contracts, and this is happening despite the uncertainty of what's going to happen in Madison regarding the union rights. But as we learned tonight, not necessarily all districts, various teachers unions have agreed to terms they're not satisfied with, but have approved them because of what they fear the legislature may take away in terms of collective bargaining. One area school district has not renewed its contract with its teachers. It appears the board has other plans. Fox 11's Becky DeVries tonight explains where things stand in New Holstein. While demonstrations about employee contracts have been quiet in Madison, a small, quiet demonstration took place outside of New Holstein High School before Monday night's school board meeting. I would like to see the board sit down and negotiate with our negotiating team and work out a an agreement. You know, right now there's absolutely no communication happening between the negotiating team and the school board, and the school board is just refusing to talk. The controversy in the whole state at the present time is that a number of school districts have gone back to the table with the teachers and negotiated a one or two year extension. The school district in the whole scene, uh, Board of Education has not done that, but they have started the process last week Thursday to establish an employee handbook. And that's what has, has caused the unrest. That handbook would replace teacher contracts. We signed a declaration, all of the teachers telling uh, the school board that we just simply did not want an employee handbook, that we wanted to keep our contract. We were willing to make concessions for um, our wages and for the uh, re teacher's retirement. The school board's agenda did not include any items related to teacher contracts, but teachers spoke to the board about it during public comment time because some say it's the only way to reach the board. I sent you an email again with my concerns but I have still not heard from you. While teachers say the board isn't speaking to them, the board isn't speaking to Fox 11 either. Board members referred us to President Oscar Bilkey, who had no comment, except to say the board is preparing a response to the teachers. In New Holstein, Becky DeVries, Fox 11 News. The contract for New Holstein teachers expires the end of June. The interim district administrator says there are still a lot of unknowns, such as the amount of federal money, state money, in the district's next budget.